Hey, are you a graduate? Do you want a high paying job at the big four? Well, you're at the right place. My name is Ishraq, I'm a second year order associate at one of the big four and in today's video I'm going to go through 5 quick tips that landed me my job at the big four. Apply early. Make sure you submit that application as soon as you can. You've heard the saying, the early bird catches the worm. Well in this case it couldn't be more true. Applications are given priority on a first come first serve basis. So the sooner you apply, the earlier you'll get to the next stage of the recruitment process. And the closer you are to getting your dream job. In my case, I made sure to apply within four days of the window opening and I was still one of the later candidates to receive a job offer. Research the firms and their values. A lot of early stage behavioral assessments are there to test whether your views align with the firms. Therefore, it is critical that you understand what the firm's beliefs are, what their core values are, and tailor your response to meet their criteria. People don't realize but it's at the early stage of the recruitment process where most people lose out, so it's important that you do the extra work to reach the next stage. I've made sure to add a link in the description to each Big Four's core values, so hopefully you can use that as a guide. Have a full understanding of the role you're applying for. What does the role involve? What direction is the industry heading? If the job description isn't enough for you to have an idea, I hugely recommend getting onto LinkedIn and connecting with someone who's working in the position you're applying for. The more you understand what the role involves, the better your responses will be for the video and partner interview. Practice numerical tests online. The numerical test is one of the easiest components of the recruitment process that you can ace. Make sure you have plenty of practice before attempting the real thing so that you can answer the questions accurately and at a fast pace. Here, it's all about can you answer the questions correctly and under time pressure. I've added a link below to a numerical practice site that I tried out during my application process. Make sure to relax during the partner interview. Once you've reached the final stage of the recruitment process, remind yourself that the odds are in your favour. The fact that you've made it this far shows that you belong in the firm and that the firm wants you. This is your opportunity to showcase who you are and why you're the one they should hire. I'll be going into more depth about the partner interviews in another video, but hopefully this is just to set your mind easy that the final interview is not as scary as it seems. If you are rejected at any point, don't be upset. There can be many reasons for you not getting the role, such as the firm having reached their intake limit, or perhaps the job isn't for you. The first time I applied for a job at the Big Four was during my final year of university, and I was rejected by all four of them. The following year, I followed the tips I've mentioned, and I went on to reach the final stage for three of the firms and ended up landing my current job. Hopefully with these tips, you'll feel a little bit more prepared about what to expect in the Big Four recruitment process and what you can do to increase your chances of getting that job offer. See you all in the next one.